Okay, what we're doing here is called a pause interrupter center. Most people don't realize that all attention from us is rewarding. So what she's gonna do is she's gonna say puppy three times in a high-pitched voice, and then she's gonna pop a treat in little Zoe's mouth here. Um, with, if our puppy gets in the trash, and we say no, we're giving them attention and making them more likely to go in the trash again because it got your attention. So sit, and, then pop, and then put it, just say it three times in a row, treat, and repeat. Three times in a row. And all we're doing at this point is a classically conditioned response. We're just helping Zoe, when I hear puppy, 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 I'm getting a treat. Now a lot of breeders, keep going on, keep going. Uh, when a lot of breeders, when they feed their puppies, they will say puppy, 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 we call it the puppy call. So it's a very primal sound, and we use this to get our dog's attention. So the dog's getting in the trash, instead of saying, don't get in the trash, we make the sound. The dog looks, because no matter what the language is, if you say a word three or four times in a row, most animals find it arousing or interesting. So you're redirecting your dog's attention away from getting in the trash by making an interesting sound. And then we also like to pair this with what we call hand targeting. So once the dog looks at you, then you chop your hand like this, and your puppy runs over and puts its nose in your hand, you give them a treat, and you've redirected them away from the trash. Then you would give them a, some carrots to chew on, take them for a walk, or put the trash away, or do something else. So it's only going to temporarily redirect them, but most people accidentally train their dogs to do exactly what they don't want, because every time they chew, they bark, they jump up, we say no. And all attention yes. is rewarding. That's like giving your dog a treat. But if they're about to do something, then you make the, pu the pause or after sound like pause, puppy, puppy, puppy. Like, and I'll do it right here. Puppy, puppy, puppy! Well, like, wow, she's more interested in who's got the treats. But the puppy looks at that sound, and then you do the hand charming. So I want you to say, uh, call her, call, and then I want you to, I'll put your, uh, with your left hand, put your left hand up, and then, and then and say, make the sound. Puppy, puppy, puppy! And then chop your hand. And there we go. And so yes. now little Zoe runs over, touches her nose to Brandy's hand, and instead of getting in the trash, now Brandy can take her for a walk or do something else. This is a much better way of stopping your dog from unwanted behaviors, plus it's cute. This is called the positive interrupter listen. Yes. So, puppy, puppy, puppy. There you go. Yes.